I'm originally from South Texas in the Rio Grande Valley and um, a lot, I feel like down there, a lot of it deals with con like connection and family and togetherness. I lived in Japan with my, my in-laws and my family, my husband, and took a lot of photos there also. And it was, I guess, a way to remember and to kind of connect back and make this kind of weird space of memories. And then moving here, I was able to broaden my world of, of art and seeing what so many people are doing, have done, and yeah, staying, staying connected. process has changed quite a bit, but now whenever I'm going to make a new piece, I, I start with um, looking through photos that I've taken of, it could be either spaces or people, things, textures, and I collage those together to see what kind of fits best to create a kind of fractured, surreal space. And um, once I created this kind of collage, I then paint it onto a canvas, taking it away from the collage and transforming it more into a painted space. You can create all these wonderful worlds for using oil paint that come from my imagination, from my collage, and it's just the medium that I find captures what I'm trying to do most. In my work, I try to get this ordinary and this extraordinary, or find the ordinary and the extraordinary, or the extraordinary and the ordinary, and kind of squish it together into a painting. I feel like my paintings come from me, um, and they don't necessarily have to be explained to be understood. I want to continue playing and experimenting and having fun in the studio and seeing where that takes me naturally. Professionally, I do hope that I will teach in higher education because um, I feel like my professors that I've had have such a huge influence on the trajectory of my artistic career and I enjoy teaching people so I want to, con I would like to teach and continue my practice at the same time.